Michelle Abraham has everything you need to know, from local leads and celebrity interviews to trending topics and more. Right now on Good Day Stateline. Hi and welcome to Good Day Stateline. It's Monday, May 1st, if you can believe it. We have a great show for you tonight as we kick off our search to find the Stateline's best tacos. But before we get to that, we have one of the stars of the new episode of Accused on Fox, Betsy Brandt. How are you, Betsy? I'm good. Glad to be here. Happy May. Yeah. Thanks for being here with us. So this show is one of the coolest concepts on television I think I've ever heard of. Every single episode is like a mini movie, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And it's, and it's so great. But you know what's always good? I'm also a huge fan of the show, full disclosure. So, but every week, and it's one of the shows that my husband and I can watch together. So we're like, oh my God, oh my God. But you know it's going to be good. Yeah. But then we also talk about it after. And then I ask other people, I'm like, did you see that one with? And so it's... I, it's it's a fun kind of uniting kind of kind of show, but it also it makes you think. You're like, because you relate to these characters so much. Mm -hmm. I'm, I think, what would I do? Yeah. Would I do that? I mean, there's sometimes I'm like, oh my god, no, don't, you know. But we we root for them. That's also the other thing I love about it. Um, so it's a uh, it it's complicated and tricky and great. Yeah. So you get to be a part of the episode that airs on Tuesday. Tell us a little bit about your character and uh, the episode. She's a single mom. She's got a teenage daughter who um, is amazing, but maybe not the easiest teenage <laughs> daughter. She's uh, really smart. She's questioning things. She wants to know the identity of her birth father. And um, Kara, her mom, really doesn't want her to know. Yeah, it's a <laughs> that makes that happens a lot, right? Doesn't it? <laughs> when we have a secret like that in a family right? like this, it's like, a, oh. right. I, we, I mean, I was just saying, it was like, oh my god, like with ancestry now, like twenty three and me, I'm yeah. like, what do I want to know? What do I not want to know? What do I need to know? What should I know? You know, um, and I, but also, I just feel like we have information thrown at us all day, and and we have accessibility to everything, and so. We all want answers. Yeah. I think that's just such a such an issue that we have right now. Like we all want answers and we expect them. I love a, a show like this that brings up those topics, like you said, and you can actually talk about them afterwards with your friends or your family or whoever you're watching the show with. And we like the part that, you know, if you happen to miss an episode at some point, it's not like you have to watch them in order. You can watch the episode you're in and then start back at the beginning or yeah. just pick and choose. Oh yeah. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. There's no pressure to it. If you, if you missed last week, that's okay. Mm -hmm. Um, and it's also, it's, it's nice that like, there's kind of a through line through the show, but it's also, it's like, you know, it's going to be different. Yeah. You know, that's nice too. Absolutely. You know, so we, uh, we also are a fan of baking, breaking bad here at the station. And we know that your character, Marie, we had a question for you because Marie loves purple, but do you love purple? Is that kind of like something you had in common? Or I do not. <laughs> I do not. And whatever feelings I had about purple, purple, I got so much of it, which I loved having like that she she had that specificity yeah. on Breaking Bad. But there, no, there is no purple in my house. <laughs> You're like not even close. All right, one more question. Uh, this week on our show. No, but when I see it, when I'm driving in LA and I see someone in a purple car, I'm like, oh, I get you. <laughs> like I get you in a way other people don't get you. So true. So true. All right, Betsy, before we go, it's, it's taco week on our show. Uh, we like to celebrate food all the time. So let me know, what is your favorite kind of taco? <laughs> Oh gosh. Oh man, I love a mushroom taco. Okay. Do you know what we also do really well in LA? What? You can find a good potato taco. No way. I, I mean, listen, I've got nothing against calabacitas. I will do a calabacitas taco, but um, I think potato is probably, yeah, that's my like decadent fave taco. That's pretty awesome. We don't have those here, but we're going to have to look up a recipe online. Betsy, thank you so much for joining us. Oh today. man, I'm from the Midwest, so <laughs> I will you know. I will eat a potato in any form. <laughs> Thanks so much for being here, Betsy. Thank you. Enjoy the show. For sure. You can uh, watch Betsy tomorrow night on Accused right here on Fox 39. We'll be right back with our friends from Poplar Grove Floral. We're going to help them pick a winner of their Petals and Pastries class. We'll be right back.